Hey everybody, insulation day. Um, as you can hear, there's quite an echo, oh, 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 in here. Um, so yeah, I'm going to uh, start insulating. Um, my buddy Lauren stopped by last night. Um, I've never finished a house, believe it or not. Um, so he stopped by and I was asking him questions because I wasn't sure if I needed to do the electrical first or if I needed to do the electrical and the plumbing. Well, then I kind of got thinking, well, if I do the plumbing, it's going to be uh, closer to the exterior wall, so it's going to be more apt to uh, leak. Um, so what I did was ask his opinion. He says, no, no, no. He says, do the insulation now. And then when you go to do the electrical, you take a little drill bit, you drill a small hole through here, you push the insulation back a little bit and run your electrical and your plumbing. So uh, that's what Dakota and I are gonna do today is uh, start the insulation because um, as much as I love the schoolie, it is uh, cramped to say the least. So, um, we're going to try to get this insulated. Um, I bought eight rolls of R13, which will fit in these, uh, in between the two by fours perfectly. And then some neighbors of mine um, gave me two rolls, which is really cool. So I have a total of 10 rolls. I might have enough to do uh, the circumference or the walls, whatever you want to call it. Um, but I'm, I'm not sure. So, uh, I'm not going to make you guys watch me for two hours doing that in slow motion. So we're going to do time lapse. Okay, so I uh, got one part of a wall done already. I quick estimated that I'm getting five, um, pardon my ignorance, I, I can't think of what the hell these are called, but I'm getting five per deal. So I think I'm gonna end up having to buy probably three or four because I do want to insulate this floor here for uh, sound purposes. Um, so, but if I were to just do the walls, I think I'm like one, maybe two rolls of insulation short. Um, so, hi Dakota, hi Dakota. Dakota's out here cheering me along. Yes you are, yes you are. All right, quit spaz. <laughs> So um, the sun's finally come out, which is awesome because what did we learn? Solar panels love the sun. Um, I think my Starlink, because it's been getting cold that night up here, I think my Starlink was uh, heating itself last night and drained my batteries down to 50%. Um, so I turned that feature off because there's no snow. Uh, once I get the rest of my solar array up, then I can turn it back on and not have to worry about it. But, um, yeah, uh, it's coming along pretty good. I don't know how long I've been working on it because I didn't pay attention to what time I started. But I should be able to get this uh, pretty much cranked out uh, in, I don't know, an hour or two. So, um I'm gonna let you guys go for right now. I'm gonna drink some coffee, let the dog go potty, and then uh, finish insulating, and then I'll get back with you guys. I might film a little bit here and there, but we'll be back.
Okay, it's the day after yesterday. Um, so I got most of the insulation up as I showed you. Um, and I had to do some running around today. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Goofy dog. Anyways, I had to do some running around uh, the first thing this morning. Um, and now I am back. No, I had to get two more rolls of uh, insulation. I, I obviously need much more than that, but just to do the walls, that's what I needed. And uh, I grabbed some paneling from my old house and I got some uh, two by four so I can put a wall in um, to give that strength. So, yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna hurry up and finish this insulation and then we'll catch back up when I uh, start the wall. Okay, so I've got all the insulation done except for about a three foot piece. Uh, dance. <laughs> Go that out. Um, so now I'm going to start putting in the wall because this is kind of flimsy, uh, being 16 feet wide and they don't make wood like they used to. So um, first thing I'm going to do is clean this floor because I have tracked quite a bit of dirt in here so is the dog plus all the insulation chunks from cutting it and everything else there that's how we roll all right, so um, yeah, just to connect the ladder, I think I will leave it at 12 feet. So I need to measure from that wall over eight feet, mark it, and then I'll put one of the 12 foot boards up and then another 12 foot board up for the top and then a 12 foot board for the bottom. So, um, what do I do with my tape measure I just had? Oh, there it is. Sorry. Oh, gosh, I'm tired. Okay. So there's my buddy heater. Uh, my camera decided to show you. There we go. All right. Oh, I'm tired. That's five foot, six foot, seven foot, eight foot. So allegedly this is eight foot right here. Now we'll, uh, of course. There's eight foot. That was certainly off. And uh, so, yeah, I'm gonna measure all these real quick and get them marked, and then I'll get back with you guys. Okay, I cheated a little bit, found a straight two by four, and uh, that's how I measured it. Uh, where did I put my razor knife? That's always good for a drill. Uh, oh, there it is. So, yeah, I was going to do nails, but screws are fine. These don't look like they're three inches. 
Hmm. Okay. <coughs> So, yeah, um, put this together real quick. There we go. So, I'm going to find the probably this, like the straightest 2x4x12. Uh, by by this one looks pretty straight. See if I can do this. Okay, so there's a reason I did that. You can see why here in just a second. So that way I can uh, pivot this. Should have a pocket. and straight hopefully hmm that's interesting oh cool must have accidentally grabbed a straight 2x4 that's uh, pretty much right on the money so I'm gonna Drop a couple more in here every so often, and uh, then we'll put the next board on, and then we'll have to cut the end off. It's nice to see that wood's coming back down again. It was quite insane there for a while during this whole thing. There's a uh, That's weird, so hmm, interesting. Okay, cool. Now we can try to do the same thing with the next one. Uh, this one looks straight. So nice having this insulation on here already because, uh, there we go. It was quite echoey at first. So, I'm gonna quick uh, make sure this ends good.
So my plan is to uh, now granted I'm not going to have the uh, insulation done in the ceiling yet but I mean it's it's actually it's really warm in here with uh, I got my buddy my big buddy heater um, I don't know what I did with the plug so I don't have that plugged in the power or anything um, but I got that fired up and it's uh, on medium not even on high and it's it's warm in here I'd take my hoodie off Really? What's the chances? <laughs> I hit the hit the other screw. Jesus. All right, so now I got to do the same thing to the bottom. Get that measured. Um, I'm gonna do that again, so I can uh, put the bottom runner or whatever it's called on, and then I'll start putting the uh, two by fours in. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then uh, I'll be insulating it also. So, yeah. All right, so that end and this end's both at eight feet. But I think this board's warped a little bit. So we're going to uh, get this middle tacked down. All right, Dakota. Yeah, so, yeah, that's off. Just, <laughs> what are you doing, goofball? <laughs> You're making this difficult. My good. All right, come on, move. <laughs> come on, quit. over 71 and a half what about this one about, about 71 and three quarter I got to cut these at so I'm gonna measure them and then uh, Go cut them with the chainsaw because I don't feel like dragging the generator down here, nor do I feel like dragging all these boards up there. So bear with me. Actually, something I'm going to do real quick is so I want these obviously just like the uh, other two by fours in this building that I can't. I think, Joyce's, I think. I don't know. Anyways, um, I want them 15 inches apart so I can uh, insulate it. So <clears throat> we're gonna start here and uh, measure to 15. Get dog, my gosh. And then we'll go another 15, so on and so forth. Uh, so I know where to put the two by fours. All right, I got all those marked. Now I got to measure all these, and I it was a 70, 70 something, 71 and three quarter. So, seventy one and three quarters. All right. So I'm gonna do that and get these cut real quick, and I'll get back with you guys. All right, cool. Got all those done. Grab a handful of nails, or screws, rather. And we're going to start getting this put together. Okay. 
camera. There we go. So is the toughest part. Just gotta do the same thing to the bottom. <laughs> Watch out the corners. Watch out the corners. Get out of my face, dog. Come on, you gotta get my glasses dirty. Go away. <laughs> go. Come on, go lay down. Goofy dog. That'll do for now. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna finish the rest real quick. Mm -hmm. I can tell where this thing sags a bit. Okay, so those two are done. I just got to finish measuring right. these ones. Get two more to go. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. It's always good for a tape measure. Ay, ay, ay. One more. Blue beans. All right, last board. Woohoo! Oh, there it is. <laughs> Grab my shovel.
fish. It's not going nowhere and this should be uh oh yeah quite sturdy you guys want to see that again <laughs> so yeah cool there so um this will be a spare bedroom, and then this is going to be the bathroom slash uh, studio. Um, <coughs> excuse me. So I'm not, I'm not a hundred percent sure how I want to do this yet. So I'm kind of thinking um, stairs or steps, whatever you want to call them, for our bedroom is going to be right here. I'll put it up against here, and it'll be a little hatch or something, I don't know. And then uh, probably put the bedroom door over here. Hi, hi, Goofy. And then... Uh, so it should be eight feet wide, so how long of a, so yeah, about 24 inch wide hallway. That should work. And my computer chair. While I'm doing thinking, I'm going to break that thing yet. My gosh. This is going to be kind of my little office and i'll have a i'm going to build a um, like a little tiny desk to uh put my laptop on and i'm going to put my bird feeders right outside this window come on lap dog come on lap dog here's a good lap dog <laughs> so um yeah the computer desk will be here and then the battery bank the solar charge controllers and um, the router will all be right here for the for the Starlink. And then, um, so I'm going to have to measure from here straight out that way. See how big I, wires I need to get. So, um, yeah, yeah, this will be perfect. So from this line, <laughs> my God, dog. So from this line. To this line, oh, that's gonna be kind of small there though. So yeah, anyways, so from this line that way, and then this way a little bit will be the uh, the bathroom and the shower, um, and the batteries will be here. Um, so basically, I just have to measure out two foot, build another one of these, um, and uh, yeah, we'll be golden. So, um, yeah, if not anything, I hope I entertained you guys. So, uh, I'm going to call this a vidya. So, um, yeah, I got the wall done, got the or wall insulation done, got this wall built. Oh, my gosh, dog. <laughs> so, um, the only thing I got left to do is insulate the ceiling, uh, insulate this wall, then put up all the paneling or whatever I end up doing, uh, put all that up. And then um, insulate this just for noise purposes. Insulate uh, over there by the kitchen. Do all the wiring, all that fun jazz. So I got a lot of stuff to do. But 
this is what I'm doing today and yesterday. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you didn't, I'm sorry. But uh, yeah, give it a thumbs up. Uh, haiku. I, I don't know what that even means. But uh, yeah, thumbs up. Share with your friends. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. And uh, keep following me in my uh, life's journey of living off grid. Um, and bringing my wife here. <laughs> and my dog, Dakota. So talk to you guys next time. Peace.